Hey guys, in this tutorial I want to show you how to play AAA PlayStation 3 games on RPCS3, the PS3 emulator, with the best performance and maximum frame rate. Imagine playing God of War 3, God of War Ascension, Infamous Series, Uncharted Games and many other PS3 exclusives on maximum frame rate. So let's get it started. Okay, wait a minute. Uh, you probably realize that what I just said was totally cap and um, emulators don't work that way. In fact, if you don't have a high-end PC, you probably cannot play AAA games on RPCS3. This is the recommended requirements for running RPCS3. And I should also mention that it's better to use RPCS3 with a desktop PC rather than a laptop. But if you want to use use a laptop, make sure it has at least an 8 core CPU as well as having a compatible dedicated GPU. The last thing that I want to mention is that most of the games are completely compatible and playable on RPCS3 even with a medium end PC. But in case of the games that are in game compatibility wise, um, they need a high end PC. And most most of these kind of games are AAA games, although you can play them at lower FPS. Okay, first you want to head on to rpcs3.net, click on download, and here you have the option to download for Windows, Linux, and Mac OS. After the download is finished, it's better to create a separate folder. Then you want to extract all the files in the zip that you just downloaded into the folder. Before you run RPCS3, make sure that Visual C 2019 is installed on your system. Otherwise, RPCS3 won't work. Now you can open RPCS3. First off, we need to install the PS3 firmware. In order to do that, go back to RPCS3.net and choose the Quick Start tab. Scroll down and click on PS3 System Software. When you are greeted with this page, scroll down and choose Update using a computer. And here you can download the PS3 firmware. Head back to RPCS3, go up to Files, Install Firmware and choose the file that you just downloaded and wait for it to install. Now let's add games. The games could be a PKG file which you can drag and drop on RPCS3 in order to install them or they could be a folder. In this case, make sure you choose the folder which contains two other folders named PS3 game and PS3 update. Drag the folder and drop it into RPCS3 in order to add the game. I will also link a video about how to to dump PS3 games down below. So now we are going to configure our controller. In order to do that, go up to the Paths tab and choose your controller in the Handlers box. Just make sure it's connected. Now, before you start your game, make sure you have the right configuration set. Right click on the game and choose Check Game Compatibility. Click on the game title and you should be greeted with the wiki page. Here you can see the settings that are different from the default settings that are already set. So you only need to change these settings. For example, for God of War Ascension, I should change the SPU block size from safe to mega. And the same goes for other settings. In order to change or create a new configuration, right click on the game and select create custom configuration. I should also add that uh, you can change the resolution scaling in most of the games. But some games like God of War 3 or God of War Ascension do not support resolution scaling. The information about whether or not the game supports upscaling is in the wiki page itself. Although for these games there are patches that you can apply in order to upscale the resolution. So after 
you're finished changing the settings, save it and right click on your game again and go to manage patches. If your game supports any patches, they would be visible right here. Here you can turn on any patch that you like. You can also read the description of the patch in the notes box. After you're done, you can play the game. That was it guys. If you're still confused about how to maximize your gaming performance or perhaps how to update your games, you can check other videos about RPCS3 and the playlist here.